Hello everyone! Thanks to everyone who voted on Dating Sim Month over at my Patreon, we have a winner. And it is... Come on! There we go. It's Hottiful Boyfriend, if you couldn't tell by the pigeon in the uh, opening logo. For the pigeon, by the pigeon kind of thing, you know. Uh, also, I may need to mute my phone, because apparently I forget to do that sometimes. So let's do that. There we go. No fun. Okay, so... Uh... Yeah! Welcome to Let's Play Hotful Boyfriend. If you don't know what Hotful Boyfriend is and why there are pigeons on the front screen here, it's a dating sim about dating pigeons. The main character is female, and you're dating boy pigeons. Okay, <laughs> this is gonna be a thing. And, uh, I'm looking forward to it, but this is going to be awkward! So, I guess I'll just use... yeah. So, I, 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 I just... if you click this, you get to pick your language that the game comes in. So, you get everything from Japanese, uh, German, Russian, you know, Italian... So yeah, we'll just uh, we'll just leave it on English. Yeah, this is gonna be a thing. So we're gonna do new game. So get ready for me to read a lot, and you'll be getting voice acting. Anything that's not voice acted will just be spoken normally. So yeah, this is gonna be a thing. Uh, I don't remember what year it came out in. Uh, but it was I want to say like. 2014-ish. Could be older than that. Welcome to St. Pigeonations! Please enter your name! Uh... Ultima. Uh... I guess Mantoid makes a last name. So I guess that's that. This is going to be awkward as fuck. Is Ultima Mantoid okay? Why, yes, yes, I am okay. Thank you for asking, game. Thank you so much. I'm glad that you were concerned with my well being. Uh, oh, yeah, that's right. Keyboard is a thing I can use in this game. So, Ultima Mantoid is okay. I wasn't sure if I should go with uh, a female character name I've been using or if I should just stick with me, but since it's me, I'm just sticking with me. Powerful Boyfriend includes a powerful visualization module, allowing even the birdiest of birds to appear as normal humans when first introduced. Display human portraits? Yes. Configuration saved. Now, I have played about 45 minutes of this, so... St. Pigeonations, a school blessed with extensive curricula and facilities. Let's move the mouse out of the way, just in case. It's already been a year since I... Oh, yeah, I guess I'm reading this. It's already been a year since I ended my ordinary life and walked through these gates. I should probably say, the school is known for one thing in particular. The school is Japan's... No, the world's greatest gathering place for gifted birds. Birds who want to study the arts, the sciences, even sports, all come to St. Pigeon Nations. The teaching staff and student body are both made up of a diverse blend of birds of different backgrounds and species. I'm often asked why I chose to come here despite not being a bird. Yeah, for real. I would like to know that. Um, oh, and before I go any further, again, I want to reiterate, thank you guys that voted over at my Patreon to make this game happen uh, between this Dream Daddy and Honey Pop. So, this one by a single vote over Honey Pop. <laughs> um, also, I do still have another Patreon poll to go check out. Uh, between Doom 1, or not, sorry, Diablo 1 and Doom 64, which game I'll play first between the two. They both get played, but yeah, and it's a dollar. 
So if you can part with a dollar, you should go support me on Patreon and vote for crazy stuff like this. Anyway, I'm often asked why I chose to come here despite not being a bird. It's a long story. <clears throat> not every day I see you rushing along like this. I don't know who this is, so I'm just going to voice it as me. Ryota! Usually you'd have been ready for an hour by now, Ultima. Overslipped. Uh, introducing Ryota, uh, Ryota Kawara. These names are Japanese, so I'll do my best to pronounce them correctly. Ryota Kawara. This rock dove is named Kawara Ryota. We've been friends since he was barely hatched. He can be a little mischievous, but he's responsible and kind. <clears throat> Breakfast was a little hard to catch today. I can't relax without red meat inside. Living as a hunter-gatherer sounds tough. I'd be happy to make you breakfast, you know. I might take you up on that offer when starvation looms. Thanks, Ryota. <clears throat> and save by the bell! Oh, the bell already? Come on, we need to hurry to class. Jeepers, no good being late on the first day. And so Ryota pulled me along into the school. Today is the start of a new semester. I wonder what lies in store. It was all I could do to adjust to the atmosphere last year. Better make up for all that lost fun. Also, I may want to actually keep an eye on my phone so I know how long I've been recording. <clears throat> I have a drink, so if my throat gets dry, I will not hesitate. The most splendid and greatest academy of the pigeon, by the pigeon, and for the pigeon. First term. I think we're in 2-3. Ryota and I are in the same class again. Old faces, new faces. A strange thrill fills my heart as I look around at the assembled birds. I hope we all get along. Here's to the formation of many happy memories. Oh, the teacher's here. Good morning, everybody. Er, I'm Nanaki Kazuaki. Almost got that right on the first go. Nanaki Kazuaki. I seem to be your teacher this year. I need a face. Give me a face. Don't give me just the bird. I specialize in math and physics. And also some other things. Sleeping. Sir, wake up! It's homeroom! He sleeps with his eyes open? Oh, good. Okay, so that's the teacher. <clears throat> this quail is Nanaki Kazuaki. He's a famously soft... Uh, Soporific math professor. Jeez, I cannot read today. So he'll probably have a softer voice since he's, uh, he looks like he's one of them laid back teachers. I had heard the rumors, but I hadn't expected him to fall asleep just like that. Apparently, he's well known as a mathematician. Just goes to show great minds come in all forms. Ah, I'm sorry. It's a little warm in here? Or isn't it a little warm in here? Which reminds me, we have a transfer student. Please, inter introduce yourself, Shirogane. Wow, that tail, though. Dad, dad ass. <clears throat> What's the point? I have no wish to speak with commoners. Do not think I'm here because I wish to be. So we got a sassy proper bird. Oh well, I guess that's that. Hey, 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 that's no good. Sorry, I muted there for a second. I didn't think y'all wanted to hear me cough. But he doesn't want to introduce himself. But we can't just let him break the rules like that, sir. The system will collapse and we'll all turn into kulaks and dissenters. Well, when you put it like that, could you at least say your name, Shirogane? Shirogane le bel sequoia. I'm a proper bastard. It seems this fantail is Shirogane sequoia. His feathers would make any birdie proud. Is that like any pony? Did they really go there? I just realized that was a one word thing. Oh well. He's pretty stuck up, but then transferring is never easy. I hope we can be friends. 
Sakuya sits down, glaring daggers at Ryota and me. I think this little bird is telling me there's going to be trouble down the line. Lunch already! Today is slipping by so quickly. That reminds me, I've had these books out from the library all summer. I'll return them now. Where is everyone? Aside from the receptionist, there's hardly any birdie here. Huh? Is someone looking at me? Probably just my imagination. Or not. A morning dove stands in a dark corner staring in my direction. Morning doves aren't very common in Japan, but apparently they're everywhere in America. Um, did you want something from me? He looked away. Not really. I'm pretty sure it was him who I felt looking at me. There's no one else here. Are you sure? Yes, I don't want anything with you. It's the things you're carrying that I'm interested in. He glances at the desk, as if to say, Hurry up and return them already. Oh, sorry. <laughs> they were really, uh, uh... They were a little too dense and I never finished them. Were you waiting for them all summer? He silently returns his gaze to his book. Maybe he's in a bad mood. I'm ma- Oh my god, I forgot. Last names go first in Japan. This is awkward. I'm Mantoid Ultima, a sophomore. What about you? Your Nagaki. Fujishiro Nagaki. Freshman. So, that looks like a, uh, that looks like sort of a, um, a hush tone. Fujishiro Nagaki, huh? Morning doves are pretty rare here in Japan. Maybe it's just his voice, but he seems kind of sad. Leave me alone. He's reading his book again. Okay, sorry to bother you. I keep meeting depressing people today. Now that I have that out of the way, I think I'll head back to class. Wait, isn't that... You should have been instructed not to approach me in school. Come on, Sakuya. What kind of thing is that to say to your own brother? After all these years? My brother? You must be joking. You've never once been a brother to me. Please don't try to talk to me again. I have no time for half-breeds. I'll be going now. Hey, wait, just a... I guess even if we're in the same school now, what's done is done. Hadn't meant to eavesdrop, but I think I just overheard something juicy. Yay for gossip! We're gonna go gossip and look at all the pretty birdies? The ever-popular trendsetter and ladies' man, Sakazaki Yuya, is Sakuya's brother? I wonder what the story behind that is. Hey. You heard that whole thing, right? Are you a friend of Sakuya's? I, 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 I'm, I'm sorry! I didn't mean to listen in on you. <laughs> no sweat. I tried to stay sexy and suave in front of all you little ladies, but that there wasn't too cool. I feel like everyone sounds the fucking same when I look at the portraits. This fantail pigeon is Sakaz uh, Sakazaki Yuya, an upperclassman. I've never talked to him before, but he's famous, or infamous, throughout the school. Every birdie knows of him. You're Ultima, right? Uh, how did you... I know every birdie here. Besides, <clears throat> you're the only human. A single poppy in a field of rye. Did you say you were a friend of Saku? Oh, did you say you were a friend of Sakuya's? Not exactly. We had a rather ballistic introduction this morning. We're in the same class. That's all. I never, th I never have thought that stuck-up aristocrat wannabe was your brother. Aristocrat wannabe. He is an aristocrat, actually. The genuine article in the flesh. He is. 
is a bit of a pain, so good luck, mon ami. Adieu. He really is a noble bird. I've never heard anything like that about you, you though. Probably a twisty business. Yay for... I guess it's April the 8th. I think that's... That would be right, I think. That's... Uh, that's all for today. Stay safe, everyone. Yay! Sorry. Let me be more enthusiastic. Yay! Huh? Sir, where's Ryota? He said he was going to the infirmary. Maybe you should go and see if he's still there. Now that I think about it, Ryota always did have a weak stomach. I should go to the infirmary just to make sure he's okay. E excuse me. No birdies here? Oh, that hurt. There's no one sleeping behind the curtains, and the doctor isn't here either. My hunter-gatherer instincts feel no presence. There's no birdie here. Ryota? No reply. The infirmary is empty. Weird. Did he go home already? I feel a little nervous poking around the empty room. Now that I think of it, I haven't been in here much before. Unlike Ryota, I'm perfectly healthy. Whoa! They've got all kinds of drugs in here! I like how we go directly to the drugs! I am not... I, I swear, I am... Yeah. Ethylpar, Trifa, Lucio, Benzene. What do these even do? Care to find out? That's a fat pigeon. D -d 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 Doctor! I'll feed you all sorts of things if you want. Hmm? No, thank you. Is he trying to push his drugs on me? Okay, uh, so everyone is fucking, like, dark and mysterious except for the first person we met. Great. This partridge is Iwa Iwamin uh, Iwamine Shu, the school doctor. He's a rather creepy in person and has a bad reputation among the student body. Everybody knows that even just talking to him can bring you down with aspergillus, psittacosis, uh, uh, or even worse things. And I never even heard him come in the door. Ninja Doctor? I, I, that would honestly be something I would say IRL, not even gonna lie. I would just be like, hey, Ed, uh, Ninja Doctor. Alright, what does this guy gonna sound like? You don't look like you have a good reason to be in here. Did you need something? Um, I heard Ryota Kawara from 2-3 was supposed to be here. Him? He's already gone. Oh. Why didn't he come find me before going home? S sorry to bother you. I'll be going now. Ah, <sighs> finally out of that den of evil. Ryota's already gone home. What do I do now? Oh! I never got around to joining a club last year. Maybe I'll go take a look at some of my options. I think there are clubs for baseball, soccer, track, kendo, migration, bird watching. Let's go to migration, because I'm not a bird. Wasn't there another one? Anyway, I'll start with the track team. I ran in middle school, and it's always funny watching the birds hop around. <coughs> I think their club room is on the ground floor, off to the side. A white dove is having a tantrum outside. Coo! Coo! This is no pudding for a man! Who? Uncle Sam rejects it. It is a lie. A vicious falsification. He's dancing around on a squished pudding. Hey, that's not very nice to the pudding. This game is literally like it's me talking to these people. Wait, is he an actual bird? Like, he's... What? I don't... What? What? This is Oko-san. He doesn't really look it, but supposedly he's a fan ta a fan tail pigeon. I think? Either way, he's hyper. 
So, uh, he's an actual bird, so... <clears throat> Okosan has suffered a deception most vile! A wretched betrayal! Betrayal? Okosan instructed that pudding be provided for new members! But this is no pudding! Ousted, scorned, betrayed! Dragged into the street and shot by those he trusted most! It's squished and filthy, but the thing under his feet looks like normal store-bought pudding. What's wrong with it? Spare the jests, young lady! Uncle Sen used the wing attack! It's super epic! And this is why I started drinking. Okay. Pokemon references aside. <clears throat> They'll rue the day they crossed Okasan. He'll have them flayed, hanged, shot at dawn, he will. Oh, I can use the mouse, too. Okay. I mean, I don't really need to. I'll just keep using the keyboard. Okasan must now train to achieve, achieve true pudding. Farewell. What is he? Is he a race car or a bird? And he's gone. He's a good runner. What does pudding have to do with the track team? I, that's what I want to know. And so ended the first day of my second semester at St. Pigeon Nations. Kazuaki. Okay, I think that was... Uh, uh, I think we want to choose the class council today. As you all know... No, Kazuaki. That was the... No. As you all know, the school doesn't require you to join any club. If you want to, if you, want to you can. But if you don't, then you're free to go home after school. Uncle sent his time only for the track team! That's good. What about you, Shirogane? A foolish question. I already hold a position here. Oh, that's right. You became student president when you were admitted. Nepotism, ho! Oh! Don't we get to vote? Just coming to school is enough for me. There's Ryota. You have to take care of your mother on your own and all. Hmm. I wonder what I should do. Join the... Uh... Honestly, none of these appeal to me. But let's... Oh, hmm. Let's go with the library staff. Let's see. We have student council. That would put me with the, the stupid asshole noble bird. The track team would put me with hyperactive Okasan. Let's do library staff so we can talk to the quiet freshman kid. That's everyone, isn't it? Have fun! So it's gonna be hard for me to remember the voices in this game because I... All the birds look the same. They're all freaking white except Ryota. Today's an elective day. What should I do? I have, uh, stats? I don't remember this. Attend... Ooh. Oh, God, now these appealed to me. I liked math, gym, and music in school. Ooh. Let's do music class. We sang birdie melodies. It was a little tiring, but singing together is fun. How do you sing birdie melodies as a human? Ultima leveled up. Charisma increased by five. Yay! So now I have a charisma of ten. Nice. I am rather charismatic. I think so, sometimes. <clears throat> I'm on receptionist duty today. Better hurry. Boring as usual. The library doesn't seem very popular. Not enough books? It's on the fifth floor, though, so at least the view is nice. Sitting here twiddling my thumbs is bad for me. I wish someone would come ask me something. 
There's no birdie here. I wonder if it'd be okay to close early. Uh, I wish I could just spread my wings and fly away. Planning to jump off the building? The window there is rather good for that, Miss Receptionist. <clears throat> oh, okay, it's the hushed, key, the hushed person. And Nagaki, when did you... I've been here all along. I never noticed. He's almost as bad as the doctor. You're thinking I have no presence, right? It's okay. I already know that. You certainly seem to like this place. Yes, is that a problem? Um... No, books are nice. They are. Why don't you join the library staff, Nagaki? Uh, you could read whatever you want. I already read whatever I want. Touché? You, you shouldn't slack off, Miss Receptionist. And with that, he takes a book and is gone between the stacks. What a strange bird. Ah, <sighs> sitting at home is so relaxing. Oh! Tomorrow is the class hike. Wait, do I live in a cave? Should I prepare anything? We won't be going far, so I don't have to. Well, health first. I think I'll have some udon and go to sleep. Today is the hike! We've stopped for a break on a hillside. Who should I talk to? Talk to... Yeah, let's see who our options are. Hmm. <coughs> There's Okasan, Kazuaki, Sukuya. Yeah, we just want to talk to Ryota. Because, you know, he's the only freaking sane one. <coughs> Ryota, let's eat together. Sure. Great view, huh? Huh? Is that your lunch, Ultima? Yep. It's a calorie... M calorie meat? Calorie Emmy? I don't know what the fuck that is. It's a pretty sad thing to bring on a picnic. No, it's not. A great man once said it's the ambrosia of the gods. Jeez, if you eat like that, you'll be dead on the roadside by the time we head back. Here, I'll share mine. Really? Well, thanks, Ryota. Ryota? I guess it's Ryota. And so I got to eat half of Ryota's lunch. His cooking is so good. We can save the calorie ME in case of a survival situation. I'm gonna just call it a calorie ME. Today is an elective day. What should I do? Well, we will decide that later. So I'm gonna go ahead and save. And I will see you guys in the next episode of Hotful Boyfriend. I still can't believe I'm playing this game on this channel. You guys voted it. Honestly, I was expecting Honey Pop or Dream Daddy to win, but here we are. So, uh, I'm gonna save over my old save file. Let me make sure. Yep. There we go. Anyways, thanks everybody for watching. I'll see y'all in the next episode. And until then, take care and have fun. And I will see you next time with more Bird Dating Simulator. Because bur 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 bur